As we look to the final competitor in this men's event, few would have predicted as you see his fans cheer him on. Other skaters, actually, that's uh, a junior pair team from France, uh, Romain Telemac and Luca Coulon, that Boyang Jin would be the winner after the short program. Wish him all the best in having another clean, solid skate in Angers. Could replicate the quad looks from the warm up. But lands the quad toe. Short of rotation on the triple axel. Oh no, single axel. Double three turn in between the triplets and the triple toe. Try doing all they can to continue to support Boyang. China's Bo Yang Jin completes his free skate. And it interests me that the skating community and the diehard fans tend to fall in love most with the skaters that have quality components, quality skating skills. 
But Bo Yang Jin, whilst he, that's not his strength, he is amassing more and more fans because of the longevity in the sport and his continued desire to be on the world stage. And after the event yesterday, he quite simply acknowledged he continues to skate because he loves figure skating, has always loved figure skating. And I love figure skating and the, you know, so many of us do that enjoy the sport. So we are behind him and his continued participation. Just unfortunate that on this night, he couldn't repeat the success of the short program as he bids to return to one of the world leaders. Here's the loose. We saw quad loose in practice and warm up. But unfortunately that's under rotated with the fall. As Brian Orser looks on. Triple Axel also a little under rotated. And then consequential single Axel. So Bo Yang is a skater who shot to fame with his technical element score prowess and brilliance. He yesterday, although the winner of the short program, as we see that double three turn between the triple triple. Although he won, that was based on the cleanliness of his skate. He was actually fifth in the component scores. So for Bo Yang, when the tech score isn't working, there's not a second mark that he can rely on to keep him in contention. And so unfortunately, he is going to have a similar, a similar sort of flip to Adam Xiaohim Fa in the rankings, because although he's given a Spider-Man as an homage to his most popular ever program, as a stuffy. Boyang is likely to drop the standings, but hopefully this experience and winner of the short program is something he can carry as motivation for the rest of the season. Aye, aye, aye. 11th of the 12 on the free skate, and indeed, he does exactly that. He flip-flops with Adam Xiaohim Fa from first to eighth, and Adam eighth to first.